the story of the femur? It is a bone of power. Because <laughs> it is the biggest and the longest and the strongest. That is why I painted it in these intense colors. And that is why, shh, it's a secret. Nobody knows this until now. I put in the words to my favorite poem about the power of the human. It's called Invictus by William Ernest Henley. I strongly recommend you look up the entire poem. The words I put here are, and yet the menace of the years finds and shall find me unafraid. <laughs> and we're all here to learn anatomy, so here's some anatomy. This is the head of the femur right here. This divot is called the fovea of the femur, and it is an attachment point for the ligamentum teres, which attaches the femur to the hip. This is the greater trochanter. This is the lesser trochanter. They are bumpy, rough surfaces that serve as an attachment point for all those powerful muscles of the hip and the leg. And over here we have the medial and the lateral condyles off in the distance. And those are the things that sit on top of the tibia to make your knee joint. All right, that's the femur, the bone of power. <laughs> And let's look at this animal up close. If you like What's the Story videos, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. I'll be dropping new videos every Thursday where we'll be, we'll be learning the story of the different parts of our human body. Uh, you can learn about anatomy and a little bit about painting and maybe become a true anatomy nerd just like myself.